Hey guys, I'm Denise. I'm Kevin. Kevin's Corner is here. Yeah. We are here. Good to see you. We got good stuff to talk about. We do. The Knights are 2-0 and in the playoffs. Yes. Uh, I went to one of those that last game. You did. Uh, but let's talk about the bingo. Okay. And we were talking about your wheel we had sitting right here. We did and talk you, about that. And you did that. Yeah, that's going every day in June at the 3 p.m. session. And how many days has it been going? It's been going, you know, since we, June started. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that makes sense. So yeah. it's going well. It's going very well. It's so exciting. Everybody gets excited for somebody else if they get, you know, they're a single winner and they get to spin. And we're like seven, between seven and ten winners a session. That's just cool. They're getting, you know, extra prizes, extra cash, bingo vouchers. You know, we got a Samsung camera on there. Somebody won that already. Oh. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. And then we got coming up. We have uh, coveralls all day on Father's Day on Sunday, the 18th. So we'll have $1,000 coveralls at every session. Come in, you'll have that. You'll, you'll also have uh, the sizzle and six ball on that day. And we are giving out Father's Day daubers on that day. So yeah, it's cool. And then, you know, National Bingo Day. We'll talk about that coming I just up. walked in here. One of your customers was talking about National Bingo Day. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's cool. Well, let's talk, about, let's talk about hockey and let's talk right. about our sports. All right. Well, Knights are up 2-0 in the finals. Yeah. So exciting. I went to the last game. It was thrilling. It was unbelievable. Yes. Uh, all those goals, my goodness. It, you know, it was so loud in there. So I've gone to a game in the first series, then the second series, and now third series, and now to Stanley Cup. So I've been to these playoff games. They were all very loud and just incredibly awesome, but not like a few days ago. Well, I think Un you should have a seat anyway the whole time, <laughs> well, you know, for all of the local games, you know, because you're Kevin from Kevin's Corner. Yeah, well. I'm a, I'm a beggar. There. Just putting so it I can't out there. Be choosy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so awesome. So if it gets offered up, I go. Yeah. But uh, you know, I'm sure that was maybe the last one. But still, it was just just thrilling. Yeah. Um, so we're up 2-0 in that. Yeah. And uh, looking forward to the next one. I'm taking it home. Uh, as you know, we're. We take this on Thursday, so two hours from now, the third game's puck is going to drop, right? So, you know, I'm sure they'll have their hands full, and uh, by the time you all see this, we'll know that result all together. Yes. So it's going to be great. Exciting. Um, then the NBA, uh, Heat and Nuggets. Uh, nuggets are up two to one in that series. Okay, and, uh, and you were saying, tell me, you know, refresh. Yeah. You talked uh, about them. Yeah, that they're really good, and uh, I forget what I said. Well, don't forget, you said okay. that, yeah. But I have another point. Yeah. Let me get to that. <laughs> you know, there's a stat in that game. You know what a triple-double is? I don't know that. So a triple-double is an offensive, defensive stat. Uh, you can either have double digits in scoring, okay. assists, rebounds, blocks, or steals. Okay. All those are important stats in basketball. Yeah. So it's usually points, rebounds, and assists. Okay, so you get double digits. Well, the Nuggets had two guys do that. Wow. It's like uh, their best player, he had like 30 points, 20 rebounds, and 11 uh, assists. So those two players were like holding that game and, and oh, keeping it going the whole time. It was just unbelievable. And it's, it's so cool. And it's my favorite stat, the triple-double in basket. Yeah. It's way better to me than someone scoring 50 points. Yeah. Because assist, you're a team player. Yes. Rebounds, you're doing the dirty work. Absolutely. Points, you're a skilled person. Yeah. So I think that's really good. On that same note in hockey, you know, goals, assists, uh, they have a thing called plus-minus mm -hmm. that how many goals your team scores or gives up while you're on the ice five on five. Mm -hmm. So there's a stat that's kept, you want to be in the plus, Okay. you know? And I just think it creates, if anybody that's leading that or in the top whatever in the league, uh, it's them better than goals and assists. It makes sure the you're more important to your team. Oh, right. I yeah. feel that way. Yeah, I, I agree. Uh, but anyway, uh, I'm so looking forward uh, to the game. It's going to be awesome. Yes. 
And Can't wait to find out. Oh, we got the Belmont Stakes uh, Saturday. Yeah? Yeah, I almost forgot to mention it. Yeah. So it's the third leg of the Triple Crown, but there won't be a Triple Crown winner. But all those horses from the Derby, a lot of them, there's nine of them, all racing in this race. They skipped the Pimlico. Uh, in the Preakness, and now they're here at the Belmont Stakes Saturday. Wow. Forte, the, that was the big favorite that scratched. Yes. He's back in this. Wow. Now, since it's not for Triple Crown, all these horses now, going forward, they're not just gonna be racing their three-year-old counterparts. They can race older horses. Okay, so, you know, in a couple months, you'll have the Haskell at Mammoth, and then you'll have Breeders' Cup in November. Yes. Uh, and that's, like they'll be against older horses mm -hmm. so but they're getting older themselves yeah so this is kind of i really hope in forte wins because he was supposed to be something special before yeah. he scratched yeah so that thing to watch we'll keep our eye on that for sure that's yes. uh, i'm going with forte in the belmont by okay the way. sounds good all right all right lots of good stuff here head on over to our youtube channel to watch kevin's insight on all of this stuff always and uh we'll see you here next week see ya Bye.